We're going to spend the next five days walking. And we're going to spend the next five days walking because the time has come to really demand action from our political leaders. The one part of the global warming movement that's been missing is the movement. So what we're doing with people all across the country is getting local communities together, kids like yourselves, and asking our leaders to step it up on global warming. One, two, three, seven. put up this website uh, eight days ago now, and already we have 146 groups in 40 states that have promised to be holding actions on that day. This is the North Wilmington Step It Up 2007 observance, one of over 1,300 such events across the country. Representing District 12 in the Lower East Side of Brooklyn. This is a crisis. This is not an issue for the future. This is an issue for now. It's time for us to wake up and take the head and make ourselves be heard, you know? It's going to be streamed live on a webcast to organizers all across the country, so uh, everyone will have a moment. So you, they've all been dispersed across the whole country, and now tonight they'll have a moment of unification on the website. We're looking at the um, basically the images as they're uploaded to a stream of images that we can look at that have kind of a description of what happened and a report on numbers. We're not going to have all 1,400 report back, but I would say. You know, definitely over a thousand for sure. Uh, so, four fifty-three reported back. There are hundreds of thousands of people watching us right now on a webcast across the country. These are the same hundreds of thousands of people who took part today in the largest grassroots environmental protest since Earth Day in 1970. And so it's incredibly beautiful to see people lined up along the levees in New Orleans, holding hands, joining hands. It's incredibly beautiful to see people underwater, scuba divers off the endangered coral reefs of Key West. It's incredibly beautiful to see skiers coming down those dwindling glaciers out west, to see all the places and the things that matter to Americans. <laughs> is an indication mostly of the fact that Americans now want to take real action, finally, on the question of global warming. People in every state in the Union Young people, old people, people in rural areas, people in cities, evangelical congregations, sorority chapters, every kind of American that you can think of agree on one thing, which is that Congress needs to get to work to cut carbon dioxide emissions 80% in the next 40 years.